And we're joined by the perfectly titled Rebecca oh, Perfect. Nice. Sorry, well, thank you. Had to get it out there. <laughs> uh, who's running us through? Well, been running us through the films of 2014. So looking ahead, Oscar season, obviously on the way. It is indeed. What can we look out for? Well, you can start by looking on New Year's Day. There's a couple of really good films out on New Year's Day. Uh, the Theory of Everything, hotly tipped for the Oscars with Eddie Redmayne playing Stephen Hawkins. That looks phenomenal. Oh, it yes, is amazing. Yeah, His transformation yeah. is incredible. You've seen, you've seen that already. I've seen that one already. Okay, yeah, right. it's brilliant. Um, and then also another one that's out, which is one of my personal favourites for, for 2015, is Birdman, mm. uh, which is a really interesting story about a washed up actor who plays an iconic, or played an iconic superhero back in the day. And he tries to to redeem himself after his career go- takes a bit of a nosedive um, and he puts on a Broadway play. Um, and this really is the comeback of Michael Keaton. Um, this is a fantastic film. It's it's shot in a way that it looks like it's only sh- uh, done in one shot right. all the way through. So you follow him backstage at Broadway. You see him interact with all the other actors. You see him do some brilliant Michael Keaton <laughs> uh, stuff as only he could do. And it also has um, Edward Norton and Emma Stone in it as well. So it's got a great cast. Mm. It's touted as kind of an actor's film because it's all about actors and lots of actors will kind of relate to this, how it is backstage trying to put on a play, the stresses, all that kind of stuff. And this is the film that's come out of nowhere again and put Michael Keaton back on the map and said, hey. And he was Batman. Awesome. so He was. So there's a lot of, of a, art imitating yeah. life in this. So that one's Great. one of my big recommendations. But it's an actor's film, but us millions will see.